solid figures. You've learned about one-dimensional figures such as lines and rays. Lines and rays are one-dimensional because their only dimension is length. You've also learned about two-dimensional shapes such as rectangles. Rectangles are two-dimensional because they have two dimensions, length and width. When we find the area of a rectangle, we use the formula A equals L times W or area equals length times width. A solid figure is three-dimensional, meaning it has a length, a width, and a height. Take a look at these three figures. Which figures are solid or have three dimensions? Let's examine the first figure. It has three dimensions, length, width, and height. Because it has three dimensions, it is a solid. It is a certain type of solid known as a rectangular prism. What about the second figure? Is this a solid? Let's see, how many dimensions does it have? It has a length, a width, and a height. This figure has three dimensions, so it is also a solid. It is a certain type of solid known as a triangular prism. And finally, what about the third figure? Notice it is flat. It has a length and a height, but there is no third dimension. Because this figure has only two dimensions, it is not a solid.